morning everyone. This time we are going to tackle all about fish. And we are the group one. So good day everyone. I'm Eva Marie Abelia and today I'm going to introduce to you the definition of fish. So what is fish? Fish refers to the degree of higherness and lowerness of the tone. Sounds are higher or lower fish according to the frequency a vibration of the sound wave producing them. So, fish has two types, which is the high and lowerness of the tone. Good morning, everyone. My name is Kipper Isias, and we're going to talk about all about how, how to create a pitch. pitch. Pitch words are created similarly to stress words and pitch words. They have the following characters. One of the characters are outward pitch, lengthening, increase of loudness, how, however, there are differences between stress words and pitch words. Both in their purpose. Go. However, there are differences between stress words and pitch words. Both in their purpose. In short, the stress the stress levels of speech words are louder, longer, and have greater change in pitch than the stress syllables. Of stress words, speech words are also communicate more information than stress words. In the following sentences, the words like and words are stress words. The words water and baby are stress words and speech words. So for example, I'd like some water. Here, the pitch of water is emphasized. The walk. Where's the baby? Here, the baby or ba is stressed with with the word baby. So let's move on. Good day, everyone. I am Jacqueline Amadilia, and today I will discuss to you all about the purpose of pitch words. Pitch words are used used for a variety of reasons. Usually, they highlight highlight new information, give special emphasis to a specific detail, show uncertainty or have contrast between two things or ideas. Good morning everyone. By the way, I'm Fritzi and Arnas and this time I'm going to talk about the importance of pitch. So, let's begin. Pitch at the beginning tells about kind of information is coming up. So when the speaker speaks or deliver her sentence to you, you can determine what kind of information he can he or she can give to you. It's either bad news or good news by by using the kind of kinds of pitch. The kinds of pitch is the lowness and the highness. And the second one is pitch in the middle of sentences conveys which words are most important. Like for example. Gels moving in the California next week. So the word California is the highlight of the sentence. And you can determine what country or where was Jill's, Jill's moving. So it answers Jill's moving in the California next week. So last, pitch at the end gives no one's to what just said. So this time, no one's... Uh, we, Let's unlock first the word no one's. No one's is the expression of sounds or the shade of the sentence, uh, the shade of the word from the sentence. So, just like what I said earlier, the, when, the, when I say the sentence, Jill's moving in the California next week. So, the shade or the highlight, the expression of the sound, uh, when I persuade the word California, so... It's the speaker approach or she or he was the speaker wants to convey to you. Speech perception is crucial to speech processing. As speakers use speech to communicate important linguistic information like tone and intonation. And by using speech, you can determine what the speaker's mood. It's either happy, sad, angry, or surprising, exciting, and etc. And that's all my report. Thank you. So one of the purpose of speech words is to highlight new information. To highlight the information of an intonation unit that is new, the stressed syllable of the word conveying the information is given a higher pitch. This is the most common pitch pattern. 
So, for example, for California here, is the given infor information with a higher pitch. So, good day everyone. I am Mary Jane Alvarez and in the continuation of the discussion of Miss Jacqueline Abadilla, the second purpose of pitch word is giving special emphasis to details. So, if a speaker chooses new information can be given an, an extra high pitch. This tells that the information carries extra importance or that the speaker might be sharing surprising information. So, for example, Jill's moving to California next week. So, the word California here is the new information can be given an extra high pitch. Here is another example or characterization of the new information. Go. So, let's move on to another topic. So, this is the third classification of pitch words, showing uncertainty. A pitch pattern called a scoop, pitch and shown uncertainty, it, the pitch starts slow, then quickly falls slower before coming back to its original low position. In this pattern would be used to show surprise or uncertainty, but not shock or surprise about specific information. So here are the examples. Jill's moving to California, California next week. Here in California is showing a here, the, the sentence is showing that the speaker is, has an uncertainty of the location of where Jill's is moving. So, California is lower than, lower than the other, other words. So, of course. So, here, the last or the fourth classification of features. Showing contrast. When contrasting and or correcting previous information that the stress syllables of the pitch word usually has a rising pitch. Here, Jill's moving to California next week. So here, California has a rising and falling, falling stress that refers to new information. Good morning, everyone. We are here to conduct an activity about the topic pitch. And I am Abel Mianca, and I am Abel um, we need uh, students to participate with this activity and each student must conduct a sentence with a high and low pitch words. And you can use this example to identify which is the high pitch and low pitch words. So I need one representative uh, to construct a sentence. Go. So I need one representative from... Go. So I need one representative from the group to construct a sentence with, with a high pitch and low pitch. So I give you three minutes to construct and analyze your sentence. And then after it, you are going to explain it in front Use uh, with your answer. So hello everyone, this is my example of my low pitch. I, by the way, I have a high pitch. I am going to discuss one example of low pitch. So... Where is it? I met a uh, homeless person in New York State. It emphasizes um, low pitch because while the way I pronounce and express this sentence, it shows that I am I was sad and I feel pity for the homeless person that I discovered. Thank you. Hello everyone. By the way, I am Marilyn and Ruth. So my task for today is to uh, continue with some examples of high high pitch. So I met a homeless person in New York. So homeless here is the emphasizing high pitch. This cause shows that they were surprised for a homeless person. 